The countdown is on for Monday's total eclipse of the sun. The most dramatic show is expected to be in cities and towns along the path of totality through more than a dozen states, where many business owners are looking to cash in on the celestial event. Here's CBS's Janet Shamlian. In the scenic Texas hill country, Kerrville is preparing for its moment in the sun, the blocked sun. How ready is Kerrville? Absolutely ready. We've been getting ready for two years. Mayor Judy Eichner says a city of about 25,000 could swell to as many as 100,000, prompting a change usually reserved for hurricane evacuations. We will have one-way traffic right up here along this bridge. So you're changing the traffic flow yes, of the city? Absolutely. Kerrville will have one of the nation's longest views of the moon obscuring the sun at 4 minutes, 25 seconds. And the clock is ticking for businesses. I got a chicken fried chicken, gravy all over. At Billie Jean's restaurant, owner Crystal Smith doubled many of her food orders. And you'll go through most of this? Yes, we'll definitely go through most of this, yes. Calls for reservations coming in as far away as Germany. Nationwide, spending on the eclipse, like dining and travel, is expected to top $1.6 billion. This coveted track of land has been turned into a campsite and long been sold out, some traveling extreme distances. We've got visitors from New Zealand, Israel, uh, Finland, Germany, uh, Great Britain. That travel expense, a high cost for a priceless experience. And the question now, will Mother Nature cooperate with the solar system? There is cloud cover in the forecast for a good portion of the eclipse path. But Nora, we can remain hopeful and the weather can change quickly. What a moment, Janet Shamlin, thank you so much.